Hi, so today I'm going to be talking about computer tools, which ones are my favorite and why, as well as their functions. So first, I'm going to be talking about autocorrect. Autocorrect is one of my top three computer tools because I use it every single day when I'm texting anybody, as well as in my schooling on my computer. The, the basic function of autocorrect is to take a commonly misspelled word and identify that word, and every single time that you misspell that word, then the function will correct that to the right spelling. So say you misspell the word and quite frequently on accident, then every time that you would misspell that word, it would find it and then automatically correct it to the right spelling. So the reason that I really like this tool is because I feel like it saves a lot of time in the editing process on just silly mistakes that could have been fixed right then and there instead of having to go back later on and fix those spelling mistakes. So next I'm going to talk about the Gantt chart. Gantt charts are very useful when you have many tasks to do but a short amount of time. And I actually just learned about what Gantt charts are in this chapter. I did not know what a Gantt chart was and after learning it I definitely think that I'm going to incorporate this into my schooling because I think it would be very useful um, for when I just have a ton of assignments or I'm busy one week and I could put my school and my work and anything else I have going on in life on there and it's just a nice organizational tool to view everything that you have and how much time you have to do it. So I definitely plan on using that one in the future. Lastly, I'm going to be talking about the find feature. The find feature is a lot like autocorrect. However, it's a little bit different because it's more useful in correcting grammatical errors. And it also is a lot more correcting yourself. So you can highlight certain things and go back in your text and then go and correct those. So basically the find feature will say you want to find all of the periods in your text. You could highlight every single period and then go through to just make sure that all of your punctuation is correct and your sentence structure and all of that good stuff. Um, I find this tool extremely useful and not just because you can go back through your text and it will highlight everything, but I think that it is better than using a grammar check because you get that practice yourself firsthand of correcting your own work and editing versus a machine or a tool doing it all on its own. Sometimes you can run into some errors with that. Um, I find that using a grammar check can sometimes be useful and sometimes not be useful. So, and overall, I think that it was really hard picking only three of these tools because they are all very, very useful. Um, but I think that these are just the top three that I use the most and then the Gantt chart is the one that I plan on using in the future. Thank you for watching.